Well, Jack's question about the impetus was answered in the early part of the next frame. Yet again, Jimmy White had the best start. He knocked in an opening break of 43. Hendry couldn't do anything about it, and Jimmy's back in again. a thin edge off two of the reds near the left cushion but he's got to miss those reds on his way back to the ball cushion or is he trying to make a plant out of this oh. well he's disappointed he played a wonderful shot there and he took the risk to be on the black but just let the cue ball run through to leave the black difficult He's played a beautiful part there, but unfortunately, Eight. such was the difficulty, he couldn't uh, hold the cue ball. Eight, Stephen Hendry. Another chance for Jimmy. As the red to the right corner. Yes, that's a good shot to force the, the cue ball so close to the side cushion. Perfect position on the blue. Yes, Eddie, Six. while uh, Jimmy keeps potting balls like that, it's going to be rather disconcerting for uh, Stephen. Seven. This opening was created because Stephen missed a long red that 15. he's usually so consistent with. If you take a risk and miss them, you can suffer for it. 22. Stephen's trying to force his way back into the match but at the present time things are not going for him and they certainly are for Jimmy. So this blue 23 and it's frame safe. That is to say 28. that Stephen wants a snooker of course. Twenty eight Jimmy White. And the frame. And Stevens had enough of that one. So the margin increases and Jimmy White makes the score 9-5.